Hi, I'm John Thomas, and this is Two Wheel Tips and Tech, brought to you in under two minutes. Today, we're gonna talk about ABS, or the anti-lock braking system. BMW is among the first to utilize ABS on motorcycles, and chances are you have some version of ABS on your motorcycle. Some models feature multiple versions of ABS, including Enduro or ABS Pro, but let's start with the basics of ABS. Bikes with ABS have an indicator light which will flash when you start the bike. It will continue to flash until the bike starts rolling and has the opportunity to complete a self-check. Once calibrated, the indicator will turn off, letting you know the ABS is functioning. As you're braking, the system monitors the front and rear wheel for locking. If the system senses this, it will automatically pulse the brakes to provide maximum braking in minimal distance with no locking of the wheels you will probably feel a pulse or a shudder in both the brake lever and the bike itself, but this pulsing makes for considerably more stable braking in unstable situations. There are some instances in which you may want to disengage the ABS on your bike. On most BMW models, ABS can be overridden using a button on the grip that shows the ABS symbol. To do this, press and hold this button until the ABS indicator lights up and remains solid. The ABS is now off. To turn it back on, press and hold the button again until the system indicates it is no longer off. Keep in mind that when this system is overridden, you will not enjoy the benefits of this technology. It's also important to remember that having ABS brakes does not replace safe riding practices, so remember to always be a safe and diligent rider. It's also a good idea to consult your owner's manual for how ABS functions on your specific bike and become familiar with it. Well, there you have it, folks, a briefing on ABS. I'm Sean Thomas. Stay tuned for more Two Wheels, Two Minutes. Rock on.